We're going to repaint the grill on my 1966 Mustang. In a previous video, I was working on the horns, and I noticed that it was kind of chewed up and chipped up from the years of rocks hitting it, so we're going to take it off of here and uh, get a fresh coat of paint on it. So let's get started. All right, there's only a handful of fasteners that uh, hold this in place. There's a couple here, some over here, and there's some down in the bottom here. So it's going to be pretty easy to get this out. And the nice thing is, is we shouldn't have to take off this whole front grill piece. It, can be, it should be just this black piece. We can take that off and then uh, we can work on that by itself. So now that we got this grill out, um, we can kind of see how the paint's chipped up here. So what we're going to do is we can just take some sandpaper and we can just scuff off just kind of the edges of this stuff. Um, if there's any little chips or something, that, just get that free stuff off of there and we'll, we can also wash it down a little bit, just kind of clean, cleaned up. And then we can just spray it from there. We don't, it doesn't need a, a ton of work um, to, re, to redo this piece. Um, so let's get uh, let's get to cleaning. I'm going to start with some 220. Um, if you've got something finer, like maybe a 400 or, or three something, that might be a little better. This might be a little coarse. Um, I don't want to take off too much. So let's just see how this comes out. Yeah, this this 220 is pretty coarse. Um, it is taking a lot off with just every little pass. Um, I'm gonna see if I can find something a little, a little finer. Found some 320. Uh, this might be, might be a little better. Let's see how this comes out. Um, that other stuff might have been too much. Yeah, this is better. It's still a little, a little coarse, but. It'll work for what we're doing here. Well, we got some paint off of there. That's good. Took off all kind of the high stuff. Um, it's not perfect, but uh, really the, the goal with this is just to get any edges of the paint broken off just to smooth it out and then um, now the next step is to, we're gonna get this thing cleaned up. Um, there's some bug guts and stuff on here that we gotta get out of there and then we can, uh, then we can hit it with some paint. All right, we got that washed off. So when it's below freezing outside and you need to wash a, a car part off, do you take it outside or do you take it into the shower and scrub it in there? Um, pro tip, don't tell the wife if that's what you're doing, because you might get in trouble. All right, let's get this thing dried off, and then uh, we can take it outside and hit it with some hit it with some paint. So now the change of plans. It is so cold outside. It's only a couple degrees warmer in the garage, so we're gonna do it in here. We're just gonna make some some light passes over it. You just kind of take our time. Well, I guess we're not going to use that at all. That. There we go. Now there's not much left to this can. I'm going to have to get a new can. But you don't want to put it on too thick. We're just going to make just several coats of it, if you will. And we'll just let it set up each time. Yeah, this is out. We got a little bit on there, so we're going to have to get another can. All right, next coat. All right, time for the next coat. All 
All right, we can probably put the last coat on. All right, that'll do it. Let's let it, uh, let it dry and then uh, we can put it back in the car. Now that the grill is painted, it looks pretty good. Um, I just, when I was painting it, I noticed that it's, it's broken along here. Um, I don't know. Oh well, I mean, I got ideas for a different grill down the road anyways, so it probably won't hurt it for now, but uh, let's go ahead and put it back in the car and uh, button her up. Well, that'll do it. Um, pretty easy, pretty easy fix. Um, just a can of paint, a screwdriver, and about, I don't know, a couple hours of your time because you got the paint set up. But uh, other than that, this one, um, this was pretty easy. Clean it up pretty good. I think we got the front of this thing looking much cleaner, much newer than when, uh, when I got the car. So, uh, all right, thumbs up. <laughs> Thanks for sticking with me. We'll see you in the next one. Today, uh, in a previous video, I replaced her. Just touch it up with some paint and uh, and put it back on. Excuse me. Mm. Oh, those don't come off. Who needs those? Well, crap. <laughs> Lost that screw already.